Welcome, welcome, welcome once again to that barefoot girl. Actually, now I'm going out on the road to try and get some food. And when I say food, I'm actually trying to get some healthy food, especially um, I, I'm actually, I'm not going to buy much, but I'll, I'll take you along because I go to this store sometimes to pick up some vegan things or vegetarian things, you know, one and two time on the little journey. Yeah, so not all quite there yet, but dabbling and dabbling and getting uh, used to that kind of eating because you know how it go already we have to purpose in our hearts in our minds that's it to do the things that are important to us eating healthy is not cheap okay guys so i'm in the vicinity of the store i'm gonna go in here it's actually called the natural food patch and it's here in Ferndale, Michigan and we are going to check out the cost to eat healthy okay so I told you the main thing I came for to deal with some spring water but I checked with the people at the counter and they said they're out of it I will be getting more tomorrow so I won't be getting water today Lakewood organic pure lemon not from concentrate eight dollars and eighty nine cents hello Oh, pure aloe. Am I to believe this is aloe vera water? Jamaican people. Maybe. I don't know. I've never tasted it. Right, so this is carrot juice, right? Organic. And this size bottle is what? 32 ounces. And for this 32 ounce bottle of carrot juice, it is $7.99. Don't take your carrot juice for granted. All right, coconut milk. This is coconut milk powder, vegan coffee creamer. For those of you who love your coffee, four sixty-nine. I don't know. I don't think this is bad. Five point two five ounces, hundred and fifty grams. That's a choice. Goat milk, seventeen ninety-nine. This so powdered goat milk. Ah, oh, seventeen. Ooh, it's kind of high, though. Seventeen ninety-nine just different alternatives let's look at they have organic steel cut oats this is $5.99 hemp seed never use hemp seed bought one recently and I'm going to try it in some stuff so hemp seed this is how much this is uh, 8 ounces and is it, this is eleven thirty-nine. so when you talk about your seeds and your grains yeah, flax seed. Ten. Well, this is a big pack. This small pack is five seventy nine. This flax seed, and this is what one pound. Get your seeds and nuts in there if you can tolerate it and you're not allergic. The other day I came in here and I was looking for pumpkin seed and there was none. I got this because I wanted pumpkin seed as well. What is demerara sugar? Anybody knows this? Demerara sugar. I don't know what it is. I gotta look it up. And this is $1.99 a pound. Just this. Oh, nutritional yeast. $7.64. Oh, that's oat bran. Not steel cut oats. It's not bad. This is $2.49 a pound. And this pack is like how much? Why we can't find a weight? Anyway, this this amount right here is for four ninety six. That is not bad. Steel cut oats are good oats, right, Anna? Lentils. Oh, I have a lot of this at home. It's not organic though. I'm going to use up the the um, lentils that I have at home. And now that should we afford? <laughs> Sorry about that. <laughs> No, I wanted to show you something here. Me never know. I didn't know that you have date sugar. I didn't know that you have coconut sugar. No, I didn't know. 
date sugar, one pound. This is 8.49. That one. Just didn't know. They have smaller pack. Oh lord. This is a smaller pack. Premium date sugar. And it is for 9.59. No, this is a smaller pack for more. Now. Oh gosh. This is half a pound for more money. I guess it's good. Date sugar. Delicious wholesome sweetener. Hmm. Hey. 10 calories. Oh, one teaspoon is only 10 calories. No, I'm going to check out them things. I bought the coconut sugar. I haven't tried using it yet, but I did buy coconut sugar. I'm going to try to use it and see. Not even taste it yet, actually, but I am going to. There is a snack. I have to show you guys. Look at this. Let me tell you something. Last time I came in here, I saw this. Absolutely love it. First of all, you know, I pick it up as a Jamaican and I say, ah, let me try it though. Uh, yeah, no, excellent, excellent, excellent treat. Three forty nine price is not bad because guess what happened? It's chewy, it's sweet, and all that's in it is organic dried jackfruit. That's it, organic dried jackfruit. That's it, you know. Nothing else in it. There's something sweet to sweet, and then it, it just chewy and it take long to eat. So I snap on it. I'm going to just wrap it up and look at the calories. So the whole container is 105 calories for the whole container. This is one serving. So this is good. I can vouch for this. This is really good. They have mango. Never tried the mango or them other things, but definitely the jackfruit is a seller. Ah, crunchy kale. I don't know. $5.99. No, $5.69 for crunchy kale. Why well, I just feel like I can put some kale in another air fryer or something like that and just bake it lightly and I have it for a snack. I mean, I really think we need to spend money for buy a kale snack. What do you think? So these are popsicles, right? Organic freezy pops with apple and grape juice, fruit, fruit puree. Uh, hmm. I guess a healthier choice. Six forty nine. dollars yeah. These are meant to be. And how many of these in here? Let me see, let me see how many. Ten. Ten of them is in here. You know them are big. They're not big. Right? But and the temptation is there to pick up the bag of twenty-four or so for probably two dollars or dollar ninety-nine in this hot time, right? But if you're making the choice to eat a little healthier, this is the way to go, right? But remember, fuck up your money. I think one of the challenges for us when we're trying to eat healthy and not to just eat a bag of junk is to find healthy junk, not junk, but you know, healthy snacks that we like, that's tasty. And they have quite a bit of stuff here. This is brown rice snaps, if you want to have rice that is. I didn't know they had this. Made with organic figs, Newman's own. Pick up yourself, Paul Newman, at home. <laughs> that was tease, Paul. All right, so, so we're gonna get try the organic jasmine rice. We definitely have to pick up one of this. I'm picking up for my neighbor as well, so she can try it. I have good neighbors in my dear. The tongue up here, good neighbors. Yeah, I have to pick up for myself. No, let no, me tell you, say, that's something that nice and good. Mm. and a sauce of jackfruit in it all right stop denise and try something different how about that this is a organic tropical mix same price everybody hold the same price 349 well one of this i'm put about one of this because i don't have all that money all right so we're going to try that and if I'm going to try the mix, then I'm not going to do the whole mango, right? I prefer to take another jackfruit for real and put on that mango. Alright, alright. Snack-wise, that's it. You have your mushrooms, you know, dried mushrooms. Lord, how much is we? 0 0.88 ounce and it is for $11.49. $11.49. Not even one ounce, 25 gram. Hmm. This is brown rice um, pasta for 69 for this. 
you know we're always looking for the replacements for our heavy food what we call you know you know our rice if you don't eat rice or want for try to eat the healthier rice for those of us who still eat rice and um quinoa is a good substitute for me yeah we've been doing pretty good with the quinoa but feeling quinoa is so expensive but then again it is organic right and that was the way i do <laughs> 49. This is 16 ounces with 349. So I don't know how much for that one. This one was what? This one is 469 for 8 ounces. All on there. Is what? Is what? Is what? Am I the one that am I to suppose that this is better because the it's more expensive? What? Not necessarily. I don't know. So far, the money said it's good. So I go with the cheaper one because it makes my pocket feel better. Three forty nine. I go with it because then I get. I'm getting more. I'm getting more. I'm getting a whole pound. Mm -hmm. I eat never with. What else? What else? What else? What else? Okay, we did the rice. These are jams and preserves, right? Look here. Jamaican people still making um guava jelly from scratch. I remember when people used to pick the guava them, cut out the worm them, right? Because them have no whole pesticide on them, them don't have any spray on them. So we used to cut out the worm and wash them, boil them down with sugar and business and make jelly, organic jelly that, that was organic. Guava jelly we used to make in Jamaica. Do people still do that? Does anyone still do that in Jamaica? Mm. Because let me tell you something now. Organic things up here, sir, is very expensive. You understand me? See, look here. Four ninety nine. Fruit spread. Same thing. Preserve. Look at the prices. Five forty nine. Hmm? Fig preserve. Yeah. Grape jelly. Five ninety nine. Hmm? Because them organic. Okay, so pancake waffle mix. This one is one pound and it's five dollars and seventy nine cents. Oh, that's tapioca flour. Tapioca flour, and this is like one pound for five minutes. Oh, the spent flour. The spent flour. Yeah, this is this is a pound as well. For spell floor and this is 6.59 these are the floor substitutes that um oh oat flour how much is this this is one pound so one pound of this oat flour is price 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 where are you let's see oh 5.99 so 5.99 for one pound of oatmeal Mm -hmm. And did you know that the darker your chocolate is better? Hmm? The more bitter it is, it's better. How much is this? 579, 60%. Okay. Bread mix. All would be interested in this. Bread mix. All purpose. No sugar added. Um hmm. Hmm. This whole floor and then they add everything else in it. So basically, we don't need to leave for no one night while we do this. First of all, how much is this? $8.99. Lord of mercy, and nearly $10. This is our half one. Um, more than half one, 11 pounds. 11.92. All right, but seriously speaking, oat floor. Oh, go on here. All right, so this traditional quinoa is um eight dollars seventy nine for this fourteen point four ounce pack if you want dairy substitutes you know like our cheeses and stuff so mind you some of these you just have to kind of play around with these things when you have a cheese substitute and butter substitute you need to play around with different brands until you find the one that said mm, this is the closest thing thus far and for me, for, to put on pizza, this liquid mozzarella cheese is it. Yeah, it's 
I'm not getting one today because I just got one like a couple days ago. And we haven't even started using that yet. Yeah, but we just make a pizza and put it on it. It tastes good. The, um, what else works good? And then, you know, because the melting factor, you want a melting factor on pizza. So it's already liquid. So that helps. Because a lot of the, the vegan cheese, a lot of the vegan cheeses, the melting factor is not there. So, yeah. We use the um, the Earth Balance butter. It's vegan, non-GMO. Six forty-nine for this, and this tastes good. This tastes good. I'm crackers and crackers and what you call it. So I'm gonna work with that for the time being. I worked a little bit with the uh, the sharp cheddar, uh, but it's not them not cheap. Because if you look at like just a little block of cheese like this regular cheese I don't know it wouldn't be $5.99 hmm? yeah but I guess if you want vegan these are the prices that you will pay right one pound to 16 ounces is for $6.79 oh so, okay no but $6.49 $6.79 all right so this is your stick butter oh go on stick butter go on well, I'm not going to be buying stick butter and this at the same time. No, it's the same thing in there. I'm just going to different form. So I'm working with this cream cheeses, just like the original cream cheese, I say. This one is a French one here. Yeah, dip. Um, yeah, never tried this either. I've done this. It wasn't bad for me. Which one? This? I think this is the one. The blue trees. This is the one I tried. It was about how much is this one? Five twenty nine. So these are cheese. They're non dairy, so they're not real real cheese. Yeah. Oh look! I was looking in the wrong place. Here is pumpkin seed. Yay! All right. So four dollars for this little pack. Big pack is seventeen. Are these? There's. They're wrong. <coughs> organic pumpkin seeds and this, this feel like a pound or so where's the weight yeah because it's $7.99 a pound and this is $7.95 so it's pretty much almost a pound so I'll get this because I need this mango mango sliced and dehydrated and it's a snack $5.60 $5.60. Jamaican people do not take the mangoes that are dropping off the trees for granted. Enjoy them. Real Jamaican sea moss. Paradise. Or sea moss gel. So they boil the Irish moss and they use it. Real Jamaican sea moss. 16 ounces. Let's see. What's the cost of this? $19.99 people. Understanding yourself. Jamaica. Don't take the Irish moss for granted. Good stuff. Somehow this just sounds so excited to me. Roasted garlic, cabbage, garlic, salt and pepper, but cabbage, boil up my inner bag. That part there. Eh? That part though. Mmm, let's leave it right here. So we're moving over to fresh produce. Potatoes. Alright, so no white that white skin potato, $1.99 a pound. Same thing for the red red um, potato. The avocado them here. One of these the other day was two dollar something. Same price. Yeah, two forty nine. So two dollars and forty nine cents for the little pear here. Jamaican people. This look at see there. It told them my hand we go two dollar forty nine cent. <laughs> Just because you don't want to eat pesticide. No, you remember when you go on a um, we used to go on a Miss Miss Green, a Miss Green at the corner there, so a Shakespeare and the little way there. And we used to pick up the lime then. Please understand yourself. Six dollars and sixty-nine cents a pound for lime. Alright? Okay? 
All right, your protein substitute. This pack of um, these mushrooms is what two forty nine. Not about. Yeah, look at vegetable four forty nine. Uh. And these are really good. I had this three ninety nine. It's much cheaper when well, it's not organic, but this was really good. Well, we got nice and fresh, and yeah. And just knowing so not eat the pesticide as much as possible. We have a whole lot of pesticide already in our bodies. So I don't know. Maybe if we can draw bricks just a little until we can get better and better. These things don't last long, you know. They don't have long shelf life because they don't have pesticide and all that on them. So you have to just buy a little at a time because you don't want them buy and waste because next thing your money gone down to be drain. So oh they have turmeric here too. Turmeric. I want one this. No boy, respect coconut in Jamaica, you know. Alright? Respect coconut, say coconut dress up. This is four dollars and forty-nine cents. Come with the straw. <laughs> Oh boy, that's cute. That's cute. And ginger, the organic ginger, this is $2.99 a pound. And I find up here the organic ginger, they're very small. They're more like ours. They're smaller. The other ones, they're bigger, odious, and full of water. I don't know why they're big, so well, I guess I, whatever they must spray them with and whatever fertilizer and all them things. Eh? Yeah, but you can get your fruits and vegetables. They're more expensive, like cabbage, um, $1.49 a pound. But normally it would have been way less, you know? But I saw you go. I did buy this. This is, this is not a soy protein, but it's probably like it. It's $6.99. You use it like meat, it's a protein. And of course, you have your tofu. <coughs> For the tofu lovers, I use the firm ones. They're, better, they're just handle better. This organic one is $3.99. Three this is not bad. So these are some other <coughs> protein substitute, but um, we used to use them once in a while, but no, Paul has been making his stuff from scratch. And they're really nice, so we don't have to do the packaged stuff, because then you avoid preservative and all of that good stuff, you know, or not so good stuff. Hi. These are half off today. The jackfruits in these are really good. Oh, really? Yeah, not inside this pack, but the, the one, the jackfruit oh, ones. One? Yeah. Oh, so I'm going to try the others too. Oh, but the jackfruit okay. is really, really good. Jackfruit is a popular fruit for us in Jamaica. It's a it's a what? Pro popular fruit oh, for us popular. in Jamaica. It's grown and on it the just trees. It grows everywhere. Yeah. So you just pick it. Yeah, it's real it. big. Oh wow. And yeah. Is it Sweet. different not having it fresh here? It's more expensive I get it. here too. Right? It's more expensive. Well, we get it fresh from the market. Oh. oh okay. Like Randazzo's fruit market. Oh. We get it fresh, and a lot of times we know the sweet ones. You know, yeah, how they choose. look? Yeah, yeah. Oh, nice. <laughs> That's amazing. One small turtle for the register and one okay. It's not cheap to eat organic. No. So do you, do you live here? Do you have yeah. a club card? Yeah. Oh, okay, cool. Very cool. Nice. So you can give me what it does. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. What brought you to the States? Family? Yeah. Family? Yeah. What does the card do again? The card is every time you spend forty dollars, you get a stamp, and then when you do that seventeen times, we give you a forty dollar gift certificate. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. Absolutely. Thank you. Thank you. Have a good day. All right. Bye bye. So that was our little visit to the um, health food store, right? They said a whole lot of vitamins and rubbings and ointments and all kind of things as well <laughs> under many different brands honey and all kind of things so maybe another day we'll do that portion of the store but yeah is this it not cheap 
Trila kabaga. Nah, that's what I'm doing. You know. You know, if you can and if you so desire, I think you should have tried it. And for many people, especially people down in other country, 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 where I have one little piece around them, we can plant. See if you can plant as much as you can now. Organic, you know. If I you plant them, you're not um kill you're not putting a pesticide on them. You're not putting up a fertilizer on them things. It's organic. Not because it's not in a fancy store and fancy bottle and fancy container with labels and brands. No, an organic. You plant it and you're not putting a pesticide on it. You treat it good, you know, for um what do you call it the yeah, the fertilizer and thing. Organic at its best. So juke something in the soil wherever you are that you can. If you are able, if the weather permits, if your surroundings permit, go for it. Do the thing. So you don't have to spend this open money for each organic. Because we live in a city and we can't. We don't have land and we don't have climate and stuff that facilitate growing throughout the majority of the year. But we give thanks though. Come to think of it, <clears throat> do you know that you can even plant kalaloo in a pot? A big, all right, say for instance, a big plastic container, one of them size bucket there. Yeah, full it of dirt and plant some kalaloo. Plant two tomato plants. I, I just that messy. Do whatever little you can do. You'd be surprised at what people are doing on their veranda, on their porches, in them little square and them backyard, in pots, big pots and stuff. At least some little vegetable come quick. You know your peppers. So you know you are you are growing these things. You have planted these things. You know what is on them. So you're not putting these things, these harmful substances on them. Organic. In your own little corner, so you spend less at the store. Doable, I think so. Did you enjoy this video? Give it a like, share, make sure to subscribe now, turn on the notification bell so you can know when I have new content posted, and check out the shorts. Yeah, bless up yourself. <laughs>